Today we're going to try a little experiment with some Dr. Bronner's organic virgin coconut oil. Recently I was reading through a thread on the White Blaze and uh, people were going back and forth on coconut oil and its various virtues. You can eat it, you can put it on bread, you can mush it on your hands, you can put it on your feet, you can put it in your hair, you can do all kinds of stuff with it. And in the course of reading through the thread, I thought, will it boil water? So what I'm going to do today is take about eight grams of coconut oil and put it in this Beget stove, Brian Green Espit stove, and see if I can get it to boil water uh, using my Tokes 550 pot with a uh, special crease put in it by Zelf on a uh, little trail designs uh, roll up cone that sits inside there. So with all that being said, let's see if it actually works. So the first thing I'm gonna say is that coconut oil is barely solid at room temperature. And in this case, it's summertime out and it's almost going on goopy liquid here so I got a cotton ball I've sopped up uh, it's nine grams I measured it on the scale so I've got nine grams of extra gooey coconut oil and to that I'm gonna sit the pot on top with uh, almost two cups of water there first thing I'm gonna do is get it lit and I give it a little head start there and hopefully it'll start to burn kind of like a candle and once it gets rolling we'll we'll set the pot on top I could do it now but I'm afraid I might smother it out it does not jump with enthusiasm it's a pretty slow burning candle like flame did some trial runs earlier, it turns into what looks like a burning marshmallow that hangs out for about 10 minutes. Yeah, it's looking pretty good. I'll get a pot on that now. All right, we'll let that roll and see what happens. While this is cooking, I can read some of the interesting things off the label. The uh, nutrition facts for one tablespoon or 14 grams of coconut oil is 120 calories, 120 of which are from fat. That would be 22% of your total daily value. 13 grams of the 14 grams are saturated fat. So indeed, it's probably not that healthy for you. One thing I'm noticing right away is it burns really, really sooty. I'm seeing a stinky soot pour out from the edges of my stove. I'm going to have to clean this mess up. Man, that is the sootiest, reekiest stuff ever. Holy moly. Hey, look at that. We have a boil. 
Jeez, it took long enough. <laughs> like 15 minutes. Um, but it's boiling. Oh, got a nice boil. Look at that. Look at that. I'm super duper boil. Did start at about 80 degrees outside. But it is, uh, did it on nine grams of coconut juice. Just move in a little closer here. Let's see what our flames are doing. It's still burning. It's almost used up. Leave it finish up and then we'll uh, get a look at the aftermath. So first off, that was a clean pot. And it's got Oh man, it's got millimeters of, of soot on the bottom of that. Yeah, that's hideous. So it certainly makes a mess. Yeah, I'm not sure I'd want to be doing this uh, any more than once, but it does work. <laughs> 